they, they usually give me a block of time. Uh, it's, it's not like the demo where I had like what, like 30 minutes to like do something. Uh, I can generally kind of get it up to more of an acceptable level of, of polish and they'll let me take a day sometimes exploring something. But you know, if, if they got a really specific idea, it'll be less than uh, a day. Um, I, I, I don't mind spending longer on something because it just means I can uh, tweak it further, make it look nicer, uh, push it in directions that I initially didn't. Um, but saying, knowing when to say when is important because you can iterate forever. Like there's a million ideas you can explore. I will punish the ones responsible. There's ways to make your suggestions seem like suggestions and less like demands. Uh, and it's easier to draw a picture than it is to try to verbally explain to somebody how something could be cool or write it in an email. People aren't gonna, they're gonna tune out. They, they need to see the thing. And um, that's, that, that, that's where my, I guess that's where I feel like my, if I have any power in my job, it's that, that I can swing things one way or another. Here comes the welcome party. Yeah, I'm, I'm not really a detailed guy. I like I like I like the blue sky. I like you know uh, imagining the possibilities, and I guess that works pretty well uh, for my position because oftentimes it helps people rein in their decision making, and uh, we get there in the end. You know. The law has been broken, and so have you, horseman. Some isolation occurs in any office environment. You know, people keep their nose to the grind. Some, some people are really, uh, they're, are really sociable and they need to be around people, but some people like to have their headphones on and just like buck down and get the work done. Uh, I, I, I'm much more in the former camp. I like being around conversation. I like to have stuff going on in the background. I like being inspired uh, by what people have up on their monitors and just like banter, you know. I like to be able to turn to somebody, especially somebody that's like, is gonna have some say you know, like, uh, it's, it's good to be in amongst the people that are directing you, because um, it's like being at ground zero, you know, you go right to the source and ask the horse, you know, if you've, if you've got a good relationship with those people, they'll steer you to that end result a lot quicker than if you're working in isolation. So I like take a clipboard and I just like camp out in an office of my choosing. Um, I try not to disrupt the people, but like I need activity, because when I'm talking and doing something else, my brain can wander and I can, I, I'm doing things subconsciously and not consciously, like oh, I'm drawing a line, it's part of a lighthouse, it's on a hill, like it just, it flows out of you a lot easier and you're not, your thinking isn't so uptight. Did this happen? What in heaven's name have you done? I answer the call. I wouldn't, I, I keep a bit division between uh, personal work and um, professional work. And I find that the two do influence one another. Like, like if you if you are doing life studies, where you're you know drawing you know gestures or whatever, and you're and you're strengthening your foundation, that's only going to help your professional work. And if during your professional work, you're you're finding some new little Photoshop trick you didn't know about before, or experimenting with some new technique, you can go ahead and use that in your personal stuff. So it's it's a piggybacking. I don't know if I spend a lot of time awake at night coming up with stuff for work. Uh, but like you, you, you want to keep the uh, the engine lubricated and you want to keep the stuff uh, you know, the, the creative train a moving. You know what I mean? It sounds so cheesy. <laughs> you know, right now games are a good place to be. It's a it's it's, it's a growing industry, and um, I'm at a company that uh, is, is is poised to do very well. Um, so I just kind of want to see what happens for now. Just put something down on paper. Just put it down. It's going to be wrong when you put it down. But on the next one, you make it right. And on the one after that, you make it even more right. You know what I mean? Like it's, uh, nobody, nobody just sits down and like farts out awesome art. It goes through uh, a disciplined process. You can look me in the eye 